Hello and welcome to Unlimited Reacts. I've just called it that, I don't think that, is that what it's called on the? Unlimited Highlight. Unlimited Highlight, that's the one, there you go. Uh, we are gonna be taking a look at an amazing routine by James Brown and it is Card Under Watch. Now, I love this routine. Um, I've seen it recently and I just thought this is one you guys have to like take a look at. It feels really pickpocket-y type, Con Manny, but also a classic magician with cards involved. I absolutely love it. And obviously, regular deck of cards, so even better. Let's take a look now. So, here we go. Just watch his body movements as well. I'm just going to say this now so I don't keep jumping in, but he does so many important things in this to set up for it. He doesn't just go into it, otherwise you will get caught. Straight away, making physical contact with the person, it just makes them like familiar with that. So when he does load the card, they're not suspecting it, which is really cool. Whether you can see your card near the top or the bottom. No? Near the bottom? No. Cheers, can I have a pen back? It is mine, bless you. It's also a cool trick. It's not like a trick your grand ever show, you know, with loads of like doing all weird counts and this and that. It's just like really cool. So definitely one you should learn. Put your other hand flat down, uh, sorry, face up. Like this on top of the back like this. The idea is I'm gonna get the card to jump. Did you feel it go? Be honest with me. So fast. Uh, give me a number between say 10 and 30. 24, okay. Hold your hand. So look, all the body movements, it just confuse it. It's just so clever. When you know what he's doing, it's insane. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, the twenty-fourth card. Can you see your signed card? Thing is, her hands are like that. She's looking right at the card, but because he's framed her hands, she's not even looking there. But it's even more strong because he's been there the whole time. It's insane. Was the one card under my watch? <laughs> you put it under his watch. Cheeky boy! No, would you be more impressed if it was under your watch? <laughs> yeah. Oh, good. Check it out, have a look. I'll take this, I'll take the rest of them out of the hallway. Thank you. She's still waiting, though. Have one of those. Cool. Bless you. <laughs> wow. What a good routine. I tell you what, that is one you guys need to be doing. Like, if you're out and about, this is a really cool one just to know and learn because no matter where you are, even if you're at a pub and someone hands you a deck of cards, you are going to be doing a wicked trick. Like, for it to appear, it's a signed card, first of all, so it's good memory. Uh, it appears under their watch, so it feels really like, obviously, how did I not feel that? Um, and it's just different, you know. It's, if uh, Every pub's got someone in it that does like card tricks or someone like that, right? If you do this, you will absolutely blow them out the water with this bad boy. So definitely take a look. James Brown, wicked routine, uh, but make sure you watch the instructions for that. Obviously, don't just try it because there's so many little subtleties and nuances and convincers that really make this fly by your spectator and your audience. Like the framing is very important. But anyway, very, very good routine. Definitely worth checking out.